Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So before I get started, I just wanted to quickly talk about something. I don't know if you can tell on camera right now, but the hives that you see on my face are the result of me eating shrimp. Knowing that I am allergic so I had a bit of an allergic reaction earlier today. The swelling has gone down, but the hives are still there. But we are just going to completely ignore that. We're not going to let a few hives ruin filming day. So, on to the video. If you saw my thrifting vlog that I posted before this, you'll know that over the weekend I went thrift shopping. And so today I wanted to just sit down and show you guys everything that I got. As soon as I got home, I literally threw everything in the wash i made sure to wash everything and also just to be safe because of covid basically i like raided the entire men's department and i was looking for a bunch of sweaters and jackets and things that i can layer for fall and winter time so the first thing that i got is this turtleneck right here it's just a plain black one it's in a size medium in men's so it's super big on me i think this is just like a really cute staple piece for fall and winter and you can pair it with jeans or even with skirts and tights so this is the turtleneck i'll show you what it, like how long it is let's see so i'm thinking of cutting it like maybe to here let's see do you guys think i look like the rock right now anyway so i'm thinking of cutting it maybe about like this short okay i'm gonna cut it and then i'll be right back Okay, you guys, so I'm just gonna cut up the shirt. So first, I'm trying to figure out what length I want it. I don't want it too cropped. Maybe up to my midsection, so right here. I am a not a fashion stylist. Like, I don't make clothes or anything for a living. So if this turns out looking like complete doo-doo, I'm so sorry. Okay, so I cut this shirt. What do you guys think? Changed into black pants because I couldn't take looking like the rock anymore. The ends are looking very messy, so I'll clean that up. But like the overall length and everything, I think it's perfect. Now it looks similar to a shirt that you would get at Zara for like $25 and I got it for, I think, $6. Yay. By the way, everything that I got was under $10, except for one item, which I got for $12, but I'll show you that later. So the next item that I got is another sweater, and it's this oversized brown one, which I also got from the men's section. This is in a size extra large. So again, it's just like a really nice staple piece for the fall. It's a nice brown, so it's really neutral and it'll, it'll go with everything. This is the brown sweater. I'm still undecided if I want to cut this one and crop it or if I should just leave it at this length. I don't know, I kind of like it. Like anything, I can always just, I can always just kind of tuck it in. Let me know what you guys think about this one in the comments, but I think it's so cute. So the next thing I got was another sweater and it's this one right here. I just love the pattern of this. I think it's so unique and so cute. It almost reminds me of an ugly Christmas sweater but more chic. I'm not going to be cutting this one because I feel like it's just the perfect length already and then you can just always do the under bra trick where you just tuck it in under your bra so that it's a little cropped if you want it to. I would probably just wear this with black jeans just because it has like that nice bold pattern so your outfit doesn't look super boring but it's so cute. So usually I'm not a fan of plaid shirts. I just feel like they haven't really been my style but I kind of wanted one just to have in my closet in case of one day I was just in the mood to wear plaid. So I found this one at the men's section. I love the color of it because it just looks so vintage to me. I think this one is like a nice neutral tone of plaid for me, if that makes sense. So this is the outfit with the plaid shirt. I don't know, I guess it would be like a really cute casual outfit. So I'm just wearing like black high-waisted pants and then a black crop top. Or I can probably like tie it around my waist or something. I guess it's kind of cute. 
so this next item is the only thing that I got that was not in the men's section and it's this faux fur vest I have always wanted a fur vest but for some reason I just never got one and I really wanted to have one in my closet for days when I'm wearing a casual outfit but I want to dress it up a little bit the fur almost reminds me of a raccoon there's no tag on this so I don't know where it's from but it's just really cute so the next item I got was the only item that was not under $10. This one was the $12 item I was talking about. I'm still not sure if I want to keep it because I just, like I'm trying to figure out outfits that I want to wear with it, but I haven't really decided yet. It's this Nike sports coat. It's just in this like really neutral beige color and then the inside's black and then it has that Nike symbol on the side. It's in a size large. Okay, so this is the jacket. What do you guys think about it? Like, I really, I really can't decide if I want to keep it or not. Here's what it looks like from the side. I feel like in like some angles, it's cute, but not sure. Like, it honestly, just looks like I'm wearing like my grandfather's jacket or like my sugar daddy's jacket. What do you guys think? Should I keep it or should I give it away? Maybe I'll just get like a few good pictures in it and then I'm going to give it away. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Anyways, you guys, so that's all I have for my little thrifting haul. I hope you guys had fun watching. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure to like this video and comment down below. And also subscribe. And be sure to follow my Instagram account at the only abs. So thank you so much for watching, you guys. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.